When your Superbox Live TV isn't working properly, follow this systematic troubleshooting guide to resolve common issues quickly and effectively. Step one, check for server maintenance. Visit Superbox's official website, community forums, or Facebook groups to see if others are reporting similar issues or if maintenance is scheduled. Step two, reboot your devices. Power off both your TV and Superbox, then unplug them for two to five minutes. This clears temporary glitches and refreshes the connection. Step three, verify your internet connection. Superbox requires at least eight megabits per second for video on demand, but 15 megabits or higher is ideal for HD live streaming without buffering. Step four, reboot your router and modem. Unplug both devices, wait 30 seconds, then plug in the modem first, wait two minutes, then plug in the router. This refreshes your internet connection. Step five, clear the live TV app cache and data. Go to Superbox settings, find the live TV app and clear its cache and data if the option is available. This removes corrupted temporary files. Step six, verify your Superbox activation. Visit the Superbox website and use their verification tool to ensure your device is properly activated and registered. Step seven, keep your software updated. Check for and install any available Superbox software updates as these often fix bugs and improve performance. Step eight, adjust VOD app settings. If buffering continues, try selecting the alternate decode option or changing the internet speed setting to faster within the VOD app. Step nine, factory reset as a last resort. Go to Superbox settings and perform a factory reset. Warning, this will erase all your preferences and installed apps. So only use this if other steps haven't worked. Step 10, contact customer support. If all previous steps haven't resolved your issue, reach out to Superbox's 24 seven technical support team for personalized assistance. Following these systematic troubleshooting steps should resolve most Superbox Live TV issues. Start with the simple solutions like checking server status and rebooting devices before moving to more advanced steps like factory reset. When basic troubleshooting steps don't resolve your Superbox issues, these advanced techniques and important considerations can help you get back to streaming smoothly. First, some critical warnings about advanced troubleshooting. Be extremely cautious with factory resets as elite apps may disappear permanently. If you've installed apps from unknown sources, remove them immediately as they often cause system instability. Overheating is a common cause of performance issues. Ensure your Superbox has proper ventilation with clear airflow around all sides. Keep it in an open area rather than enclosed in a cabinet. Before continuing, it's crucial to understand the legal implications of streaming content from unverified sources. Always ensure you're accessing content through legitimate channels to avoid potential legal issues. If problems persist, consider these alternative streaming devices. The Fire TV Stick, 4K Max, NVIDIA Shield TV Pro, and Chromecast with Google TV often provide more reliable performance and access to legitimate streaming services. For the most stable streaming experience, switch from Wi-Fi to a wired Ethernet connection. This eliminates wireless interference and provides consistent bandwidth for smooth playback. Remember that some content issues may be due to regional restrictions, and Superbox is optimized for streaming rather than gaming or running multiple apps. If all troubleshooting steps fail, Superbox offers 24-7 technical support to help resolve persistent issues.